Special thanks to Walmart Plus for sponsoring this video. your teeth wash your face and do all the rest of stuff okay good job getting dressed by yourself okay so I know we ran out of your special toothpaste so you have to just use mommy's toothpaste today but I'll order you some more of your toothpaste when I do groceries today okay but you can just use mine for today and I'll get you some more of yours because I know you don't really like that kind Today, you are just going to be spending the day with me. I have a few things planned for today. It's kind of just like a normal work and school day for us. So right now it is about mm, 8.30 in the morning. We're actually running a little bit later than I would like to be. I'm trying to make a little pizza quesadilla for Zaya real quick. That is what she's gonna be taking for lunch. We get her water bottle together. She actually woke up this morning on her own before I even knew it, got dressed, did her whole little, almost her whole little morning routine by herself without me even knowing that she was already up. I was still in the shower. Well, today it's not a pizza toaster quesadilla like I normally do, it's a pizza roll up. Just roll up cheese and pepperoni and a tortilla. I put it in foil to kind of keep it warm. Do, 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 do. A little pizza burrito. So that's her lunch with her water. But yeah, basically like I said, today is just a normal school and work day. So I need to take Zaya to school. I need to handle a few household things. I need to do some work, obviously, like online related computer sitting at my desk type of work. But then I also need to work in the sense that I have a photo shoot today. So it's just, a few different things going on today, so come along for the ride. So just dropped Zaya off with five minutes to spare. We weren't late, which was good. But now I actually really need to get some gas. I am almost on E. I'm heading over to Walmart to fill up at the Murphy gas station because I actually have the new Walmart Plus membership. I have my Walmart app right here and basically I signed up for the Walmart Plus membership. I have the annual membership and as you can see, you get special member prices on fuel. You save five cents per gallon at Walmart and Murphy stations. So basically you pull up the app when you get to the pump and it's super easy. It basically just gives you a code 
that you type in the pin pad to get that five cents off uh, special member price. Okay, so I'm back from dropping Zaya off and getting gas and everything now. I rushed out the door without even making myself any coffee or anything. So I have a few minutes before my little sister and my mom come over here. Since my mom is my business manager and my little sister is actually my assistant, digital assistant. Mm, I don't really know what the proper term for her role is, but she handles a lot of like a variety of things for me in the Raven Elise TV Corporation. So essentially every weekday morning, they both will come over here because my little sister actually works for me from like, usually it's like 10 a.m. to I think 4 p.m. that she's over here and she's working in my other office. Just like I said, handling a wide variety of stuff. And then my mom normally doesn't like stay over here all day because she has her own home office that she works from, but she'll usually come over in the mornings just so we can have like a team meeting and go over stuff, have brainstorming sessions, things like that. So we normally try to get that out of the way with all of us first thing in the morning after I drop Zai off at school. Usually when we have our little team meeting, it's a quick meeting. We're just kind of going over the calendar, the agenda, to-do list, you know, just anything we might need to discuss or be clear on in terms of like what we're all working on. Um, but today I think it's gonna be a little bit of a longer meeting because we are gonna have a brainstorming session, which is kind of a new thing that we've incorporated into our team meetings where we just brainstorm ideas, content ideas, just because sometimes it's hard for me to come up with all of the creative ideas across all different platforms and all the different stuff that I'm working on, not just talking about YouTube videos, but just a lot of different stuff that I'm working on that might be coming soon. Um, I think it's nice to be able to bounce ideas off of someone and not just always kind of doing everything completely by yourself. So I don't know, just kind of experimenting with having brainstorming sessions. This is kind of like to see my whole entire month or my whole entire week, but then I use my um, journal more for like day by day individual lists and kind of just like more specific stuff. And I need to check in with office interior designers. Yes, if you do not follow me on my home decor Instagram account, you may not have heard, but I am working with some really talented interior designers to transform this office because clearly it's looking a little bit drab. Um, it's a whole process. I'm working with them virtually, so I need to check back in with them. So we just finished our team meeting. We actually didn't even get to talk about everything. It's a lot going on in the Raven Elise TV Corporation right now. And um, we actually didn't even get to cover every single thing. We're gonna have to have like another meeting tomorrow, I think. But we talked for a long time. It's already past 11 a.m. now and I really need to start getting ready, um, getting everything ready for my photo shoot, which is at three. It takes me a long time to do my hair and makeup and everything. So. 
I need to get groceries. Luckily for me, I have Walmart Plus, like I mentioned earlier, because I am definitely not gonna have time to go to the grocery store and um, actually do grocery shopping in person. It would definitely uh, be way more convenient for me to just get groceries delivered. So like I mentioned earlier, Walmart Plus is a new membership service that gives you access to benefits that save you time and save you money. So all you have to do is download the Walmart app and they have a monthly membership for $12.95 a month or you can do the annual membership for $98 for the whole entire year. And they are currently offering a 15 day free trial. So I've already got the app and I signed up with the annual plan and the member benefits include free unlimited delivery, member prices on fuel, and you get access to the mobile scan and go feature. So with the member prices on fuel, it's at any Walmart or Murphy gas station, you save five cents per gallon. And then like I said, you get free unlimited delivery. So if you wanna order any groceries and not just groceries, but anything that you would buy from Walmart, you can order it as soon as same day, the same day that you sign up for the membership, you can start ordering and start using that free unlimited delivery. It's just a minimum of a $35 order and then you can get it delivered to your house the same day. So like I said, it's not just food products, but it's like anything that you can basically get from Walmart normally, and it's the same everyday low prices. So that's super convenient and super helpful as well because sometimes you might need like a very specific item from Walmart that's not necessarily like a normal grocery item. So it's good that you can order those things for delivery as well. If you're busy at home, but you just need something really specific, you should pretty much be able to find almost anything on here and get it delivered. Maya, I actually do have another job for you to do. Um, for this photo shoot, I am going to be shooting mainly in the kitchen, the living room, Zaya's room, my glam room. I think those are like the main rooms that I'm going to take pictures in, and right now they're all kind of looking a mess. So if you could do some set design, <laughs> aka clean it up. And move all the junk out the way. Cause it's not really like dirty, dirty. It's just, there's like stuff everywhere and I want it to be more aesthetically pleasing for the background, like more cleared out. The glam room, we're gonna do some work. We're probably gonna have to double team that, but yeah, I just wanna make the house look more photo ready. Was your gonna take a picture? Cause yeah, this is what the living room is looking like right now. The furniture is all <laughs> discombobulated. The kitchen's not looking too bad, just a little bit junky. There's a few things I think that we can move out the way just to make it look more clean and fresh in here. The glam room, however, this room is probably gonna need the most work. I'm not really sure how I wanna shoot in here. I'm just trying to take some pictures that like show me as a YouTuber, like doing what I do, like getting ready at my vanity, setting up my equipment to film, like just trying to show, I don't know, show myself filming a video or something, but I want it to look nice and clean and fresh in here and there's a lot of junk in here. This is for my new website, just to kind of fill in the website and be like, hey guys, what's up, it's Raven. I'm a YouTuber, this is what I do. So, ugh, I feel like I have cat hair all over my face because <laughs> Bougie's hair sticks to my moisturizer and it feels so weird. I need to hurry up and get ready because it takes me a while to get myself together and I need to lay out multiple outfits and I need to just make sure that I'm like set and ready to go because last time that I did a photo shoot with Rel, it was a little discombobulated. I wasn't fully prepared, so I don't want that to happen again. This time we are gonna be ready to go. So I'm gonna start by laying out my outfits. See, this is a no, no. So I already have some stuff like kind of pre-picked out, like newer items that I purchased. I'm sticking to a certain color scheme just cause these photos are gonna be going on my website and my website has like a whole aesthetic to it. So I'm thinking black high-waisted jeans with this really pretty cream colored like satiny top and then probably some big earrings or something with that. Maybe this denim skirt with this top. Mm -mm. I'm not sure. Just my go-to favorite mom jeans with this button-up blouse. So that's one, two, three, four, five looks, which should be more than enough, honestly. 
All right, so outfits, check. I think we're good to go on that. Next step is going to be to do my hair. I did re-bleach my hair recently, so I mean, the color is not perfect. It was a long story. It was some mishaps and what had happened was my hair was a certain color and I didn't like it, so I tried to remove it. And then, you know, we ended up here, which I think is fine. Um, I'm not mad at like the platinum blonde on me. Yeah, you can see that my hair is a bit it's a bit dry. The color is not even, but I think I could get it together to where it looks cute enough for this shoot today. Plus, the good thing about photos is that you can always retouch and color correct. So if my hair does look a little patchy or yellow in some spots, we can just Photoshop that and make it look good for the pictures, hopefully. <laughs> Guys, wait, I don't want to jinx myself, but I think this is the best my finger waves have ever come out ever in my whole entire life. Like, I feel like I finally got it completely smooth and laid. How I've been trying to do this ever since I first cut my hair, I was never able to like just get the swoops right and get it smooth and get it to lay down exactly like I wanted it because I really like these big, like bigger waves and it was hard to get my hair to do it um, because my hair was curly and it wasn't relaxed or anything. But I think, like I said, now that my hair is like kind of starting to get damaged from the bleach, it wasn't as curly. So it laid down a little bit better. I mean, the back probably could use some more work. I want to put this on a super low below setting so that it doesn't disturb anything. Right now it's time for makeup. I'm actually really happy with my hair. Like I'm excited my hair actually came out like how I wanted it to for once. Like every other time that I try to like, especially when it's for a photo shoot or something where I really want my hair to look good, that's when it always goes wrong. I just have such bad luck. So we're on it, we're, we're off to a good start. Hair is done, it's all dry so that it can just be staying in place. Makeup is done. I think I'm just gonna add a little bit of lip gloss right at the last minute. Hair is still looking good, I think. I have 10 minutes before my photographer, Rail, gets here. I don't know how it always takes me so long to get ready. Like, I think I can do it in one hour. I definitely can't. I think I can do it in two hours. It ends up taking longer than that. It's 321, nine minutes. So, first look. I think I'm gonna go with this for the first look figure out which exact jewelry I wanna wear with it. Whew, put some oil, some lotion on so I can look moisturized. And yeah, Rel is literally gonna be pulling up any minute now. Do just what you want. I think we're good to go. My groceries just got delivered. They just left them at my door. 
Okay, that's a wrap. I think we're finally done shooting for today. Rel just left. Um, my mom and Zaya, no, my mom and Maya just left. Zaya is still here in the other room waiting for me to cook dinner. So that's the next thing on my to-do list. I just need to change out of this into something a little bit more comfortable. When I tell you today was a hectic, busy day, like I don't even know if this vlog even fully captures the the mayhem that was today it's just because i'm really trying to multitask i'm trying to do a lot of different things at once um, because i'm really trying to do a whole entire rebrand and i've done rebrands before in the past basically where i just try to upgrade all of my stuff you know my youtube banner my website photos anything that you visually see online that like has to do with the Raven Elise brand. I always try to like update it every few years just to keep it current, keep it fresh and increase the quality as I go. But every other time I completely did it all by myself. It was just me messing around on Photoshop, making my own graphics. It was just me setting my camera up on time or taking pictures of myself or asking my mom to take a quick picture of me. So this is the first time that I've really done a fully professional rebrand in the sense of I actually hired a really talented web designer to completely give my website a makeover as well as helping with my Instagram, my YouTube channel and stuff like that. And I'm working with Rel who is a really talented photographer to help me actually get like high quality photos this time. And so it's the website, it's my YouTube channel, it's Instagram, it's like the podcast, it's like all these other things that I'm kind of like working on behind the scenes. So I'm just trying to like, I don't know, upgrade everything all at once and it's kind of a lot. This shoot was a little bit hectic. Hopefully we got all the shots that we needed. I was trying to get Zaya to cooperate for the ones that I needed like with her and I. Hopefully we got something. I think we took over, probably well over a thousand photos that we took today and I still have to look through them all. But right now, Zaya is saying that she's hungry. Luckily I did get my groceries delivered as you saw. But that's why I love having the Walmart Plus membership and that free unlimited delivery for the grocery delivery that came in so clutch today because I would not have had time to go to the store and I was literally out like I need the groceries so bad so it was just so convenient for them to literally do the shopping for me bring the groceries they left them right at my doorstep now I have everything that I need to cook dinner tonight and pack Zaya's lunch for school tomorrow so that was super convenient definitely save me some time today because I just I would not have been able to fit it in and we would have been hungry or had to order takeout which is just I'm trying to cut back on that okay back to comfy mode We're gonna do a good old fashioned quick air fryer dinner. I'm gonna do my air fryer lemon garlic salmon. I've got the salmon filet, side of broccoli. I just bought like a little bit of broccoli, just enough for me and Zaya tonight. And oh, I think I'll do some rice in the rice cooker. A little bit of rice on the side. This is one of my favorite easy meals. The air fryer and the rice cooker does all the work for you. All right, dinner is cooking. The salmon is in the air fryer. The rice is in the rice cooker. I'm saving the broccoli until very last since it doesn't take as long to cook. Did you have a fun day at school today? Yeah. I didn't really get to ask you about your day yet. Who put all those hair clips in your hair? Huh? Me. Can you show me what you did at school today? Did you bring some stuff home? Yeah. Is this what you did at school today? Um, that was from yesterday. What is that? Um, circles that would be to cut a red. Were you trying to spell something with these letters or what did the teacher tell you to do with this paper? Um, just color up all the circles red and just color these two purple. Green. Oh, so all the letter O has to be red, the M has to be orange. 
and that had to the, be the, what letter is that? E had to be purple. This had to be um yellow. This had to be green. Oh, okay, you did a good job on that one, it looks like. This one is four seeds, so you gotta have... Oh, you were counting the pumpkin seeds. So you had to count how many seeds were in each pumpkin and write the correct number? Yeah, I did, I did a good job on these two, four, four. Mm -hmm. You did a good job writing the number four. It looks like you're having a little trouble with writing the number five. We need to practice number five a little bit more. You're getting so good at writing your name, though. Yeah. Look at that. Probably got 10 more minutes on dinner. Um, the videographer that I worked with for my car tour video, I don't know by the time that you guys are seeing this vlog if you will have already seen my car tour video, but I had a video shoot yesterday for that. I worked with a really, really, talented videographer. I did not even know that he was gonna pull out all the stuff that he pulled out for this video. And he just texted me like a first, like first draft of the edit of the video. So while dinner is cooking, I'm about to watch this and see how it turned out. Oh, I'm excited. What? Okay. Oh my God. You guys. Bruh, like I said, I don't know when you're gonna be seeing this. So if the car tour video, check my channel. If it's already up, go watch it. If it's not up, get ready. Cause this video is about to be, y'all are about to be shook. Y'all are about to be shook with this video. Bruh, hold on, I gotta pause it. I gotta pause it. So the thing is, like I said, I'm trying to up my game. I'm trying to actually work with professionals. So photographer, videographer, graphic designer, like I'm hiring people who know what they're doing to take things to the next level. I've been working with editors and stuff like that, trying to work with more videographers. So a big part of my job now is to just kind of come up with the creative concepts, let somebody else actually help me bring it to life properly. And then I kind of just, I spend a lot of my time now reviewing content. So re-watching what the editors did, making notes on it, making changes, because I'm still very involved in all of my content, even if I'm not the one who's editing it, I'm giving them step-by-step -step instructions, I'm telling them what to change, how to adjust it, you know, because I still want to be very involved, I still want it to have my flair and my flavor to it, even if I'm not the one just doing everything by myself. But so far, this, this car video, it's not looking like it's gonna need too much feedback from me because it's looking really good so far. I'm gonna finish washing it, give him any feedback that I do have so we can get the final final version done, but I'm super excited, oh my gosh. Oh. I know you're hungry. Here you go. Bougie, get down. Why are you sitting here like I'm giving this plate to you? This is not for you. No. No, no, no. Get down. Are you good? I want you to try to eat all your salmon, please. Excuse me, sir. What in the world? He just wants to cut with you. No, he wants to eat my food. Let's see how you did. Okay, not bad, not bad. You got one big piece of broccoli left that you didn't eat. You don't want it? No? Okay, you ate most of it. You did a good job. Um, kitchen's not too bad because this was an easy meal, which also means easy cleanup usually. Kind of have those balls. Hmm? Grammy kind of has one of those balls. Yeah, I actually stole that bowl from Grammy's house. Why? Because I wanted it. So kitchen is clean. I'm in here chaperoning Zaya's bath time. She's in the bathtub over there. I need to pick the Mystery Box Monday winner, like I said. Basically, Mystery Box Monday is just where I pick someone who looks like they've just been really showing love on my socials. So 
whether that be Instagram, YouTube, Twitter, whatever. I kind of just look through my recent posts, my recent comments, and just kind of see who stands out to me. You don't have to like do anything to win. It's open to everyone. So I'm just gonna look through and pick somebody. And I just message them and I tell them that they won and then I announce it on my story and I send them a box full of beauty products, makeup, hair, all that type of stuff. So if you ever want to win a mystery box full of beauty products, all you have to do is just basically just interact with my posts and see if you win. Oh, I forgot to call Zaya's doctor. I definitely forgot to do that. Now it's too late. I'll have to do that tomorrow morning, but it should be fine. Let me go check what else I might be forgetting because this has been a long day. Photo shoot mystery box Monday. I checked with Ed about the car tour video. I forgot to close my doctor. Okay. So I actually pretty much did everything except for calls I as doctor, but that wasn't urgent. It's just to set up a flu shot appointment. So that can easily be handled tomorrow. Uh, I did pretty good. I only forgot one thing today and I got a lot done. Today was actually super, super productive. So, pat on the shoulder. Okay, it's almost at his bedtime. I told her that she could watch TV for a few minutes because I really want to look through the pictures that we took today. Rel always just gives me his memory card when we're done shooting so I can upload the pictures straight to my own computer. That way I have them instantly, which is really nice. Okay, okay. off I think it's time to take this makeup off oh, you know that feeling when you've had makeup on for a long time you've had lashes and your eyes like start hurting kind of Ugh, I need more makeup remover wipes too. Zaya's out of bubble bath, now I'm out of makeup wipes. It seems like, and comment down below if you relate to this, it seems like even after you just went to the store or you just ordered groceries or you just ordered stuff and you feel like you got what you need for the house, that same day, you realize you still need more stuff. Like it just never ends. <laughs> so I guess I will be placing another um, order from Walmart tomorrow, which I mean, hey, at least I don't have to go to the store. I'm not mad at that. <coughs> and then after I finish my skincare, I am getting straight into the bed. Your girl is tired. Thanks again to Walmart Plus for sponsoring this video.